That's the Electron Billitron 38 in there. Today will be the first ride on it. I installed it uh, about a week ago and fired the bike up. It, run, it ran very nice, fired right up in the cold. And uh, I had just the idle down a little bit, but other than that, I haven't touched it. Uh, today's gonna be a nice, cold, wet, shitty day. But we're riding, man, and I'm testing this thing out. Hopefully I won't have to adjust it too much or at all, actually. Because um, it's uh, just a mess today. I don't feel like getting out the tools if I don't have to. Anyways, if you don't know what it is, it's an auto carb, a metering rod carb where you don't have any, any jetting. So it always keeps a uh, perfect tune. And that never needs to be jetted for elevation or for temperature. And, uh, this is the latest... Thanks, JR. This is the latest rendition of the carb from Lectron. Uh, so I'll see you from the trail. Hey folks, I'm out here in the shed with uh, with the dirty bike. That's the way they're supposed to look though, right? Hey, I'm sorry that I wasn't able to do a full um, review of the uh, Electron Billitron 38 that I put in. I wanted to, but I had a little bit of a mishap. The uh, Let's just say this. The carburetor, when put in this bike, changed the um, power and torque and feel of this bike greatly um, to the point where I wasn't used to it. Um, and uh, about five miles into the ride, I came off a route on a trail that I've been over a hundred times, but I came off, off a route and I think I just had a little too much into it and I got flung off the trail and uh, I went chest just the tree and uh it hurts it hurts a lot and uh three days later i'm still out of work uh, i am gonna go back in and uh sit down and rest it's gonna take a while for this to heal but uh the bike went by the tree so nothing happened to it uh, but unfortunately i'm not able to get you any more of a review than than that the power is uh is fantastic I did get to open it up in one section, and um, that's scary too because it's way more uh, nutty than uh, than it was. It really it pulled the front end up where I where I wasn't expecting it to, but I was kind of prepared for that, so just in case. Uh, but um, I'm gonna have to get a little easier on the throttle. It comes off it comes off idle with way more authority, and it's just got more grunt. So um, I'm going to have to ride it a little more easily and gentle, especially on wet, uh, shitty winter conditions in New England here. Anyways, that's it so far. Sorry I couldn't give you more. Hopefully there'll be more coming with the bike. No, there will be more coming with the bike and the carburetor and a real ride review of it. when I can actually get some miles in, but it probably won't be for at least a couple weeks and also weather dependent because we'll be in January and February and you never know what you're going to get here. Hey, I have uh, some plans for the bike as well. Some some videos planned. I got some new stuff coming on for this and and uh, it's going to be nice. Plus all the great riding. So see you all soon enough, I hope. Uh, I'm going into rest. <laughs>